one, installing your skin using the Aeon Knox skin on your Cody setup. Make sure you visit Cody.tv and a big thanks to Big Noid for developing the Aeon Knox skin. Uh, the version right now is 5.6.0. What's up guys, it's XBM Connect here. And in this video, I'm gonna do a video series on customizing your um, Cody setup. I know I did a previous one on uh, XBMC regarding the Confluence mod skin, but this time, um, a lot of people have been requesting on Twitter, uh, comments on YouTube. Uh, by the way, thanks for that. Um, I really appreciate that you're actually following and supporting. And uh, I've been requested to do um, a custom skin on the Aeon, Aeon, Aeon Knox skin, uh, customizing it to show you uh, on how to do it from step one and all the way to step uh, however many videos I'm going to do um, to show you on how to customize it on your own. So we're going to go through uh, system and then settings. Again, I'm on Cody 14.1, so any Cody setup uh, will do. And I highly recommend that you install all your add-ons first before um, uh, going forward. So with that forward, if you're all ready, we're going to go to system, go to settings, go to appearance, and we're going to go to where it says skin, skin confluence, and then we're going to go to click on get more. Now when you get get more, you'll be uh, delivered to a bunch of skins right here. So uh, the most popular one that actually a lot of people has been asking and a lot of people that uses uh, this XBM uh, Cody skin, the Aeon Knox, which is the most popular one. Um, the developer right now is Big Noid, so big thanks for him for keeping up the good work. And the version right now is 5.6.0. Now um, let's gonna go ahead and install that and then click install. Just give that a few seconds. And again, I highly recommend you trying out all these other skins. Um, they're basically all the same, but a different look. And I've done tons of videos on the, each skin's look. So once you get this, go ahead and click yes. And then go ahead and click yes again. So obviously you've seen it, it's, it's all changed now. And this is the way it looks. A lot smoother, a lot uh, better to look at on your screen and etc. So let's go ahead and start um, give you the little gist of it so we're gonna go to system we're gonna go to skin settings I hope you see this and then click on that and you'll be brought up to all the customization um, part so first off before um, anything we're gonna go ahead and make sure which layout you like so we're gonna go to default or low so default is the one you just seen right now if we go to low and then change this to um, three uh, icons go out of it and this is what you'll see so a lot of people uh, use these icons, but uh, that's up to you. I uh, highly, I, I don't use it. It just complicates things and um, it looks a little weird. So we're gonna go to skin settings and we're gonna just go to five items. We're gonna keep it low. The reason why I have it low, so the background you could actually see it. And if you got a big TV or monitor or whatever, um, it actually looks really great. So. Uh, we're going to use that right now. Um, the next up, we're going to go to skin settings again um, and then go to general. And then uh, if you want to set up the backgrounds images right now, you could do it as well. But I'm going to do that on another video once you have all the sub menus are already done, which I highly recommend you do in the sub menus first. So let's go ahead and start that right now. And always add XBM Connect to all your social media.